Yo, welcome to Turbo Tuesday. Thank you for tuning in. And I'm about to steal the segment because some of the guys that are in the academy, they had a situation that they wanted answers for. And that's what we do with our people that are online. We make sure that they have the necessary answers. So I promised them that I would make sure that I did a stream. He has a son, AKA my man, the priest, who is sparring now, learning all this education through the academy. He's sparring now with guys who are elite level, top fighters in the country at the amateur level. He wants to know what critiques I had of his son. So, what I was saying that his son was doing, when he saw a punch coming in, he would pull straight back with his head up tall. And I said what that would do is it would cause him to get caught with three shots and clip by the biggest punches that you don't want to get caught with. So, my suggestion was, whenever he's boxing, and he was doing good work on his toes, slipping, I know he's gonna feel good about seeing what I was doing with him, but the key was, when you wanna slip, you throw shots, throw a shot at me, boom, you can parry, all right? These are ways that you can stop pulling straight back. When you throw a jab, boom, you can slip forward. And on top of that, you can wipe his nose. On here, again, boom, and you can go outside, pop, pop, and you can break him down. Feather rib, break that shot, woo, it's violent. Next shot, your objective, if you're gonna pull towards, or you're gonna pull away from the shot, here we go, go. You can go down, out to the side, so you're not back. And you can also step here, and just slide out, and then you can keep the movement. You can circle on them, and that's the key to prevent yourself from pulling straight back. You clip, bam, boom. Just do your dips, slip, forward slip. Something that we work on as of late, really seriously, because it also allows you to close the distance. I'm gonna give you one more move, and then we out of here. So when you slip outside, you can dip right here. You closing the gap. Instead of slipping and just going backwards, you can slip there. And if your, your offense is on tag, you can come over the top. After you slip outside, you can come over here and bam, bam, right to the temple. You can do that Mike Tyson stuff. But, like I said, I had to make sure that I kind of kidnapped his segment today. Did you have anything that you wanted to drop on your uh, segment anyway? I just wanted to let you guys know, no matter what you have or how high or how good you are, to always remain humble. Because no matter what, as fast as you get it, it can be gone like that. Boom! Stay humble. My man. And to Jason, that 12 Peaks is almost done. It's in beta stage, and I told you that he got you covered. So those guys got to focus on getting their conditioning up to date. 12 Peaks will be available the first of next week at latest. So my name is Coach Eric A. Bradley, and I thank you guys for watching. These boys right here, they team master boxing. And um, that's Mr. Philly Shell over there, right there too, in the building. <laughs> This is where you get your master's degree in boxing. Peace.